To find the inverse of a function, all you have to do is switch the x and y values and do some rearranging to get y by itself on one side of the equation. For example, y equals 2x. The first step would be to replace y with x and x with y, so you get x equals 2y. Then isolate y. Divide the entire equation by 2 and get 0.5x equals y. So the inverse of y equals 2x is y equals 0.5x. Now the inverse of a function when graphed is just the original function flipped over the y equals x line. So in this case, if you didn't know the inverse of y equals 2x, you can graph it and reflect it across the y equals x line to guess that the inverse would look about like that. 